going on guys grumpy guy here let's play a little Valheim so I uh, want to head back to the old swamp arena and uh, spend some more time in the crypts and just really have some time to explore them I want to collect a lot of iron there's so much I want to build but for now I want to make a couple of more of these poison resistance potions so that way they can be fermenting because I have seven left and um, I feel like I go through them a little quicker than I think I do. So we are going to add one there and there. And then we're going to dump all, oops, we're going to dump all this back in there. And I think we are good to go. Got my new bow set up right there. It's funny, the piercing damage is literally only one more than the other bow, but the durability is way less. So, uh, upgrading it is going to be uh, very important. So, that's why I want to get back and spend uh, some decent time getting iron. It looks like you need lots of iron. Like, you need 20 iron to build it, and then 10 or something for every upgrade. So, each item that you need, luckily you don't have to combine the iron with anything else like you did, like copper and, copper and tin you had to combine. Um... Let's see, I'm trying to, there we go. Uh, go ahead and pop that, I suppose. Just to make sure I'm ready, cause, <coughs> excuse me. Um, I haven't been here uh, in a little while, so the enemies may have um, repopulated. We're gonna head straight for uh, the crypt and finish exploring that, I think it'd be good. Uh, we'll get a good idea of how many iron you can get out of a crypt and um, whatnot. So, kind of stuck here. Um, looks like it just rains constantly in a swamp, which makes sense. I mean, it does make sense. So, I think I'm just going to avoid these guys for now, even though I could use the entrails. Uh, I did cook a bunch of sausage. I may have done that on camera. I cannot remember. But, here we are. In the crypts. My plan is to sort of spend the entire episode here uh, just figuring this out. Digging this, digging this crypt out. And, you know, kind of seeing how it works. Uh, so, here we go. And, yes, we are going to be utilizing the old trick of you know once we're full we're going to be swapping worlds and um dropping the stuff off because because you know just think about it let's say i mine this out i take a lot you know however long it's going to take me 30 minutes 40 minutes or so to get a full inventory or maybe it doesn't take that long let's say it takes 15 minutes either way i get a full inventory I can't take it anywhere. I have to, um, looks like, oops, I, sometimes I think like the world's shaking, but no, it's really just me clipping. Um, you can't take it back to your base directly. You can't teleport there. So unless you're lucky enough to have a spawn where you have like, you know, meadows right next to a swamp within running distance, then you either have to haul it back or you have to create a whole nother base. Now I can see that being something that the creators of this game probably intended people to do is to have uh, multiple bases. Let's see, I got nine iron off of those, what, what was that, two piles? So not bad. And then, yep, this room was that. And so I wonder if this is kind of like the trophy room here uh, as in comparison to the other ones. Let's see, was there anything? Do I want the bark? I don't know. I will leave it there for now, I think. Um, so, yeah, I, I don't really want to play uh, in a way that I have multiple bases everywhere. I want to have outposts, yes. But do I want to have forging and smelting at every outpost just because I can't teleport with 
you know, iron and whatnot. And maybe they're going to patch that one day. And maybe when that day comes, I'll figure out. Maybe I'll have to, you know, swallow my pride and then go ahead and uh, create smelting and forging at every outpost. But until I have to do it, I'm just going to do the little inventory trick and uh, keep that going. Because honestly, I don't have... A lot of time to play throughout the day so I, I need to make the best use of my time and me uh, building multiple bases that you know eventually I'm gonna abandon like let's say I built a base for the copper and the tin I would uh, what is that like a ruby or something oh I hope there's a bunch of iron in there that'd be sweet um, if I built a oop, oop, oop. If I built a base for the copper and tin... Oh, I thought it was an arrow. Block, son! Where's your, where's your hit points? I didn't see them. Yeah, come on. In your face! Backhand! <laughs> um, you know, yeah, I mean, every time I wanted to smelt copper and tin... Luckily, uh, we were very, we were pretty close to the house, but still, even then, that would have been a lot of running back and forth. Ooh, nice. 18. Holy cow! Uh, yep, we're going to take all this, so let me get cleared out, and we'll be right back. All right, so we're back. Um, look at this huge bone. Like, this is ridiculous. <laughs> How much does this weigh? One pound. Not bad. So, in that little bit of time, you know, we got like 33... Uh, iron, so that's not bad. Uh, so I guess they, they're they trying to vary it up a bit. It does seem like they understand, hey, you know, we don't want you to have to do iron the exact same way that you did tin and copper. Or, or uh, yeah, tin and copper. So here's iron. Let's try that. So I wonder if it, if it keeps doing that. I wonder if there's, like, something different in the mountains or something different in the plains biome. And... Um, I've heard tell, excuse me, am I getting leather scraps from this? That's pretty cool. I guess it makes sense because it's a scrap pile, but I didn't, I didn't think of, that I would be getting that. But it, I do like the fact that they give you different avenues for stuff. Um, and that they, they do seem to supply a lot of copper because, or iron, because it does seem like you're going to be using lots and lots of uh, iron. Like, I mean, hundreds and hundreds of pieces. So, if we get a hundred pieces out of each crypt, I would be I would be happy with that. So, maybe this is like the trophy room. So, I really like the green fire. Um, but I did see that I could make a green torch. I wonder if I can check that real quick. One thing... One thing that's bad, let's see, two guck, I need two guck, but it, it's a, that's really cool. Oh, look at this, a hanging brassiere, oh man, right on, oh, and I threw my chain out, the one that I had, damn, you know, what else, did I unlock anything else, uh, let's see, that looks pretty easy to make. So these are your forge improvements here. Um, did we already unlock that? I can't remember. I feel like we did. So we have forge, 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 forge. So it looks like we're going to be able to get our forge to level 5 or 6. I can't... I don't remember how that works. And a stone cutter here, so we need to... We, we definitely got a lot to do. I, I think that'll be next episode. It'll be forge improvements and um, stone cutteries. So one thing uh, is that when you hop worlds, your whatever active effects you have going on are dismissed. So you lose your rested buff and you lose your poison. So right now I don't have a poison resistance. So I'm going to keep my HP uh, high and see if I can make it a little while. But if I get in trouble, then I'll obviously back out and 
take some poison resistance, but I would like to not have to uh, pop a poison potion every time I want to hop worlds. But again, you know, I don't know how long this is going to last. I don't know, like, how much content the swamp's going to provide. Um, so far, it seems to be pretty good. Come on, big boy. In your face! Club hand. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna try the special attack on this nerd. Hwaya! <laughs> oh my god. I, I can't lie. I love it. Oh my god, I love it. Hopefully, yes! Look at that! Oh my god, there's so many. Yes, so we so far we have gotten 53 iron just in this episode alone. And, um. So I would love to craft a few other things while we're here uh you know i'd love to craft a uh so is that i think we got this one here and then we might be done uh let me pick the right thing and yeah i'd love to craft uh you know like an iron pick and iron armor and maybe even maybe even you know upgrade some of it but I will be going, yes, I will go through and I will mine the hundreds and hundreds of iron that it's going to take to upgrade everything, but I, um, I'm not going to make y'all sit through that, of course, I mean, <laughs> I think it's very interesting, I'm learning about these crypts here, so if this is your first time seeing a crypt, then right on, thanks for watching it with me, I appreciate the support very dark in here uh maybe i should get the uh the, there's that helmet that has a light um god this place is huge is there more oh my god there's so much yes chains oh my god yes boom look at that all right uh time to offload we'll be right back okay i keep hearing something i keep hearing uh droggers but i can't see them anywhere so yeah, I think that was like, what, 30 something more, and then, <coughs> <coughs> my bad, excuse me guys, sorry, plus, um, plus the, uh, what, like 30 something before that, and then I just forgot that we had already collected like 40 or something already, so we we're already over at 100 iron. Uh, just in this one crypt by itself. So, it is very dark, so my apologies. I've checked, I've tried to see if there was a brightness or a gamma thing that I could brighten up, so... <coughs> <coughs> my goodness, I might, I might need to take some cough syrup or something, because I'm not feeling sick, but I am just... Let's see, I'm going to try to get this guy down. Um... I feel like I'm gonna have to run as soon as I drop him. Yep, okay. Yeah, punk. Come on. And a skoosh! <laughs> Come on. Well, I'm just gonna beat him up because he can't hit me. I can hit him, so. Taking advantage of it. Okay, so you hear the flies? I think that's the, uh. Oh shit, I'm not even hitting the dadgum thing. Uh. Let's see, can I do this? Alright, looks like I can. I'm surprised an, an, uh, another one didn't spawn. I mean, that's crazy to me. Um, so I think what I'm going to do is, after we're done clearing this crypt out, we're going to go visit Haldor. And I'm going to buy the Divergent Cap Circlet thingamajig. And it says it's like a perpetual light source. Now, I'm just assuming that I can't have that equipped to equipped equipped as well as Mig Megging Jord. Or now that I think about it, it might just take a helmet spot. So bone mass. Big Visar bone mass. I wonder if that's the uh next boss I'm assuming. Uh holy sh why? Why is he so far away? Oh my god! Like, here's our home. 
Dude is all the way up there. That's the closest one. There couldn't have been one there. Just, ugh. Well, whatever. What can you do? Uh, nice, nice. Yes. So, it does really seem like they load you up with the iron because uh, they know that you're going to be using a ton of it. And you also get, like, amber and other sellables. So, uh, I feel like they take care of you. It's not bad. So far, I, I don't feel like this is overly uh, difficult. I think it's good. I think the, the level is appropriate. Um, yeah, I, I mean, honestly, I, I think we're going to have plenty of time to build a few things. I'm, I'm looking at that uh, reinforced iron chests and stuff. Like, check this out. Uh... Look at that bad, bad boy. I saw in the updates that it has a 6x4 storage system. What? Now, the personal chest, I don't know. I'm wondering if this is like an ender chest in Minecraft, where you can have multiple personal chests across the world, and whatever you put in one, they all have it, but if you take it out of one, it comes out of all of them. You see what I'm saying? If, if that is the case... Then you may not need have the need to teleport, but I don't know. I don't know if that's the case or not. But I would definitely love to get at least a, a set of basic iron equipment and maybe uh, helmets. But yeah, like I was saying with the uh, circle, I'm sorry, I keep like talking in circles and everything, but uh, that's just how my brain works. <laughs> um, I, I, it might take the place of the helmet, so that's something to consider. It's like a give and take. Like, yeah, you'll be able to see better. However, you're going to be light, you know, some armor, so you, you better be careful with how, what you do. But I kind of like these muddy piles being in the way because it seems like um, you can't just rush head in and then all of a sudden get screwed. So I'm kind of looking for like oozes like that one right there because I don't have my thing active um, I'm considering just killing it from here oh well I missed okay uh, oh nice brutal yes okay so come on all right I'm eating up my stamina. I'm about to lose it. Yes! Okay, so I killed that one. So the thing is, do I risk it? Do I think there's more? I mean, I got enough. I got a lot of HP, so I guess I can get out real quick. But... Okay, it seems like we're safe for now. Everything seems seems safe. So, yeah, I mean, I, I, it's it's a risk. You can see with the in the dark, hopefully. Hopefully it's not like... A piddly amount of light that's just dumb and it's a novelty I hope it's worth buying I mean it is pretty pricey but honestly I have more you know more money than I need oh also I'm gonna buy some Ymir flesh I mean why not I got all that damn money right nice more poison arrows iron head arrows sick nice dude that is nice that they give them to you for free that is, like, nasty. Yeah, I'm liking these crypts. I'm liking them a lot better than the sunken freaking chambers. But, okay, I, I see it, but it's not letting me mine. Okay, I can't go this way, so this is the only other way. And, okay, I think that's it. I think we've done everything we can do. We will see here. Um, yep, 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 yep. Uh, well, let's see. Um, let's find another crypt before we head out because I do have a lot of iron. I feel like I've gotten like over a hundred I can go process, which I'm gonna honestly have to take some wood and do it. Uh, but 
kind of want to get some more of that guck now that I know I can, you know, use it for torches and whatnot. I think I am going to go ahead and pop this out here. Uh, just to be safe, you know, just, I just don't want to, I don't think it's worth the risk is, is kind of what I'm getting at. So, it does seem that this swamp comes to an end here, around here. Uh, let me eat a fish. Ooh, I only have one carrot soup left. I feel like I go through those really quick, but uh, I, I don't, I, honestly. Boom! Oh man, I was kind of hoping I could get like a, a three for kill them all in one, one swing, but not so lucky. There's another guck tree. Maybe it's got some close to the ground. I'm not seeing any more crypts, so I don't know, is it... Where did that gut tree go? Am I losing my mind? Didn't I just see one? Oh, there it is. I'm like, what? What is happening here? Okay, my stamina is coming back very, very slowly. Um, does not seem as if it's going to have any easy ones to harvest, unfortunately. Uh, that's okay. Oops. Nope. Don't really want to mess with the leech right now. Uh, okay, can I not get up there? So, let's just keep circling around. Hopefully there's more than one... Okay, there's a guck. There's a guck tree right there. It doesn't seem like it has a lot of guck on it. Maybe... Is this the one I harvested from before? You know what? Could be. <coughs> I have no room in my inventory. I don't really need the wood. Yep, this must be the one I, t I took from before. Oh yeah, and there's the fire. We went and investigated. So, hang on, I'm going to try not to drown here. I'm good about that. <laughs> so, it does seem as if we are going to be in a black forest here. Okay. So we're just going to keep mapping out the swamp. Maybe the swamp is not as big as... I thought it was going to be, um, alright, so we're gonna, I think with the blob, uh, unfortunately, there's no, like, I don't know if there's a good time to kill him, so I think your best bet is just to, you know, blob trophy, nice, uh, I don't want those, I want a blob trophy, haha, <laughs> nice. I don't, I don't know if there's a, like, here's the best time to attack a blob. Maybe it's after they jump. Maybe it's right before they jump. I don't know. I'm just learning. So, all right. So maybe I guess we checked out the swamp. Uh, unfortunately, it was, it only has one crypt in it, and I was hoping... I was hoping that we would find more, so that way we could, uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna take this out. Oh my god. 346 damage? Holy cow. Yeah. Um. I thought I saw another one on the other side. See, this is why building outposts are... You know, it could be a waste, because, look, we've explored this entire swamp, and now I have this outpost building built that I can't really use anymore. I can, I know that there's more swamp over here. I don't know how much. It looks like it goes on for a ways. I kind of thought this whole thing was swamp. So, what we are going to do is we're going to go back to the outpost here and we are going to begin taking everything back home and I will save you guys the agony of that and then we will move all the way over here and create 
another outpost uh, right there. Thanks for chopping the tree, buddy. I think that the skeletons and the draugr should fight. Yep. I think it's booty that they don't fight. So maybe I'm wrong. Maybe this is just how it is. Maybe... Um, maybe the swamps are small and you get one crit per swamp. I mean, it's it, we got like 100 and something, 120, 130 iron out of one crit. So I can see that. So anyways, I'm going to get all this transferred over to the other side and then I'll be right back with you. Okay guys, so a bit has happened. Um, I went up here and I explored this real quick and yeah, another tiny swamp. Here is an also another very tiny swamp. So I don't know, they might just be small or I might just have bad luck. I really don't know. Um, so the plan is that uh, I had a pretty, it looked like a big swamp there and there. So uh, I'm gonna go get in the boat right there and I'm gonna sail up all the way up here and build an outpost somewhere that I feel is safe. I ended up building another teleporter right there just so I didn't have to run everything back down through there. I might go collect it one day, maybe not. Probably not if I had to guess. Uh, so anyways, I think for now what we're going to do is we're going to go visit Haldor and then we are going to uh, get the, I want to say the other outpost set up, but I think I'll just do that off camera and then next episode we'll explore the other swamp and see if there's more to it. Uh, did I leave any? Nope. Okay. So let's see. All right. What is this? Is this from last time I was here? Maybe. Uh, so what's up, buddy? I'm back. Yeah. Sorry, Halstein. Right? Yeah. What's up, man? You need some fire. Can I give him fire? Can I give him wood? I mean, let's see. I wonder if it like. I wonder if I get better prices if I um, give him fire or wood for his fire. <laughs> Can't speak. So yeah, so far impressions of the crypts really good. Love the supply of iron. I've got a uh, uh, quite a bit cooked up. Um, I want to say over a hundred pieces are cooked now, and um, <coughs> so we should be able to build quite a few things. Look at that. You gonna give me a discount? How you like me now? Alright, so let's sell... Nice! 2,000. Boy, we blinging! Let's see, I'm gonna eat. No, I'm not. Now I'm gonna eat. Take a look at my wares. Take a look at my wares! My underwears. <laughs> Sorry. <clears throat> Sorry. Alright, so let's see what this is. Ymir Flesh. Nothing. I don't know. Should I get the Yule hat? Why not? Fuck it. Does it do anything? A red cap in the style of house gnomes. Or Sandy Claus! Ho oh, oh. ho! Oh man. Ho oh, oh, oh. ho <laughs> ho! Oh my god. Uh, so let's try this thing out here. Boom! Oh my god, look at that! What did he say? Did he say Raja Dadja? <laughs> That's so funny. Holy shit. It does have a bit of light on it. It kind of looks like a miner's helmet. I mean, from this angle. Maybe it's... Maybe it's because I got his hair... Is that his hair so far back? Or is that just how the light looks? I think that's just how the light looks. Yeah, my guy... He's not having a receding hairline. Uh, but yeah. Cool. Really cool. Cool, cool. Alright, well. Let's head back to the house. And then we can... <laughs> Raja Dadja! I love it. If that's what he's saying. Um, anyways, let's head back to the house and we're going to build some iron stuff. Alrighty, so we're back here and my god. Uh, <laughs> this iron stuff is expensive. I'm going to need deer hide. A bit of deer hide. I, god, I kind of feel like I need to build some iron nails to see if, if I unlock something with that. Uh, I'd like a shield as well. 
and a mace, I think, is what I'm going to go with. Though it's, uh, it, it, it's better. It's, it's a decent, it's, it's better. It's, it's definitely better. Um, so, let's see, what do I need for the mace? Scraps wood. Uh, we need leather, leather scraps. Sometimes I forget that's there and it does uh, give me a bit of a startle. <laughs> um, okay. Yep, we're gonna be upgrade. Upgrade city, iron city. Let's see, do I have wood on me? I got like nine. Should I get more? And then let's take all, um, I don't have room for all the iron. I'm going to put you, you, you. I think that's good, right? There we go. Nope, I'm not gonna have room for all my new stuff, so. I will put you, 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 and you. I still have a lot of money left. Holy cow. Alright, so we're going to want to build this. And we're going to want to build you. So that's 40. Uh, I, yes to the helmet. Then check out the iron sword. I like it, but I think I'm going to go with the iron mace because I think it's... That's what is better for the Draugr. And what do I have left? I have 25 left. So I could build the shield. Um, it is better. And I could style it too. To make myself like uh, look cool. Uh, I think we're going to do this. Um, but if I build the shield, then I can't build anything else. I can't build the iron pick. So, it's basically one or the other at this point. Uh, iron axe, battle axe. Here's the iron axe there. Uh, well, why can't I build the shield? What do I need? Fine wood? I think I have fine wood here. I do not. Uh, dang it. Uh, well, let's put this on real quick. Let's see what we look like like this. <laughs> okay, he's, you know, acting all slouchy. Uh, let me go collect some fine wood. I'll be right back. Okie dokie, we're back. So we're gonna build, uh, the shield here. That one or this one? I want to go with this one this time. Nice. And then we're going to build iron nails. See if we unlock anything. A raven throne. Long ship. Holy cow. Nice. Yes, a new boat we can build. All right, let's see what it's going to take. Uh, the raft. We're building the raft. Uh, let's see. We need... That's not it. Here we are. 100 iron nails. Not bad. 10 deer hide, 40 fine wood, and 40 ancient bark. Dude, I could, I could build that. I could. That's going to be next episode. We're, we're going to get rid of the carve, unfortunately, and we're going with the long ship. Hopefully it can store more. Um, and then the last thing I want to do, I want to upgrade, and it looks like it's not very expensive to go ahead and upgrade this stuff. And we are going to, I think, be pretty much maxed out we'll go ahead and make the last bit of iron nails that we can nice and let us check out Gortosh and all his iron glory and see what we're up to looks like 50 holy cow nice check it out yeah it kind of looks like sconces for his on his shins though I'm not gonna lie it's, it's funny but 50? Nice, man. This is badass. Uh, I'm excited. Here, check this out. Boom! Yeah! Oh, let's get his shield, too. What am I doing? Here we go. Whap! Oh, God! It's, it's huge. Waya! Oh, man. Come on, man. Let me pose. Jeez Louise. And whoosh, whoosh, whoosh. Is it the same? Yeet! Yep, pretty much the same. See, we got the yeet sound effect. So, anyways, guys, I think that's going to do it for this episode. Next episode, we got the long ship coming. We're going to sail up to the swamp, and we're going to keep exploring and going on. Because, dude, I, I bet I could use 300 more iron. Easy. At least 300 more. And uh, this is pretty badass. 
Anyways, hope you had fun today. I had a pretty good time going through the swamp of Grain Gortosh. Can't wait to play again tomorrow. Scrubby guy out.